Yes, so now we are discussing about food business. In that today, we are discussing about a nutritionist. Nutritionist. Nowadays, nutrition is, is a must for uh, certain diseases. Particularly, uh, diet is important for uh, specific diseases. Instead of medicines, disease has to increase through proper diet is always better. But in unavoidable uh, situations, medicines and hospital is important. Diseases. Next point is diseases. For every disease, especially BP sugar is increasing to so many persons. Always using medicines will affect kidneys also. So certain uh, nutritional diet will control them properly. So that only nutritionist demand is increasing day to day. Nutritional food is uh, will never give any side effect. If you are uh, giving having a good experience then you can start independently next point is what does a nutritionist a nutritionist is an expert in the field of food and nutrition they advise people on what to eat in order to lead a healthy lifestyle or achieve a specific health related health related goal they work in many settings including hospitals cafeterias nursing homes and schools some are self-employed with their own practice and next point is a nutritionist a doctor osteopathic physicians are medical doctors for example but not all mds are osteopathic uh, osteopathic physicians meanwhile all dietitians are not uh, all dietitians are nutritionists but all nutrition nutritionists are not dietitians. So that is the information. And next point is the qualifications to next point is the qualifications to nutritionist. Becoming a registered nutritionist usually this would require you to have obtained at least a basis of a BSc honors in nutrition or, or related bioscience degree or to demonstrate significant uh, professional experience if you don't have a nutrition degree that means usually around seven years and next point is the difference between a nutritionist and a dietitian the main difference between nutritionists and dietitians is that nutritionists are not held accountable accountable by a regulatory college so anyone can use the nutritionist title some nutritionists may actually have extensive education in diet and nutrition. Some may even have bachelor's degree just like a dietitian. And next point is uh, which is better nutritionist or dietitian? Dietitians are, uh, and the nutritionists are evaluate the health of their clients and based on their uh, findings they advise clients on which food foods to eat. Both are experts in food and diet and both are considered to be healthcare professionals, professions. Dietitians and nutritionists are certainly similar but not quite interchangeable. And next point is what do nutritionists study? Dietitians and nutritionists typically need a bachelor's degree in dietics, food and nutrition, clinical nutrition, public health nutrition are related areas. Dietitians are also may study food service systems management. Programs include courses in nutrition, psychology, chemistry and biology. Next point is what is the highest degree in nutrition? Individuals who complete the highest level of education in the nutrition field will be sought for leadership roles. Some of the jobs graduates with a degree in nutrition aspire to R, aspire to R, registered dietitian, RD, or dietitian technique, dietic technician, registered DTR, a food service director, or food inspector. And next point is what type of science is nutrition? Nutrition is a science, just as chemistry, biology, and physics are science. Some nutritionist is a 
Science, it involves research on the use of scientific methods to answer questions. The questions which nutrition researchers ask are often ask are often about which foods and how much of those foods people should eat. And next point is what are the three types of nutrition? There are two main types of nutrition: nutrition, nutri, nutrients, micronutrients, and my, macronutrients. The three main categories of macro, macronutrients include carbohydrate, protein, and fat. The two types of macro micronutrients are vitamins and minerals, and these are extra molecules that the cells need to make energy. And next point is what are the seven elements of nutrition? There are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, minerals, fiber, and water. It is important that everyone consumes these seven nutrients on a daily basis to help them build their bodies and maintain health. Maintain their health. This is the information regarding uh, nutritionist. So, nutrition is also must, but uh, generally. The middle class people or below average people will go to hospitals only. Nutrition will suggest which type of diet is required for which type of disease and all this. They will take the um, list of those and they will do in home themselves. That is generally going on. Only in severe cases, only nutritionist will be and the dietitian will be there in home, which you know all the best.